The availability of world-class cancer care was dramatically transformed 25 years ago with the birth of the Tri-Cities Cancer Center. And the Cancer Center's origins lie within the strong and significant community investments that have grown to nearly $20 million in the subsequent years since its opening in 1994. These investments, made by generous donors just like you, have brought services and programs as well as state-of-the-art technology from vision to reality. Thousands of donors have contributed to our foundation because they know that the greatest way to ensure our region has world-class health care is through their own personal investments in the work being done at the Tri-Cities Cancer Center. Ken Gamboa is one of those donors who has seen the impact of our programs and has chosen to invest in our Kids Connection, a service provided by our chaplains for children who have been impacted by a loved one's cancer diagnosis. I've known a lot of younger patients who have young children. Before Kids Connection, these kids lacked an outlet to find support and share their feelings about how cancer can impact a family. Kids are resilient, but a program like this helps them process their feelings in a very healthy and supportive environment. Cancer Center Chaplain Margaret Lay runs this program in coordination with Clinical Projects Coordinator Joan Stewart and a variety of volunteers. And recently, Margaret received feedback from a friend about the impact of the program. A friend of mine was chatting with a young girl recently while they were enjoying winter sports. The girl mentioned that she was now the oldest child in her family. My friend asked why she was now the oldest child, and the girl shared that her older brother had passed away from cancer. This child's brother was treated at the Tri-Cities Cancer Center, and she and her siblings had participated in the Kids Connection program. My friend then shared with me how impressed he was with the resiliency and coping skills of this child. And thanks to incredible family support and programs like the Kids Connection, she has been able to keep things in perspective. Moved by stories of families being impacted by this innovative and critical program, Ken and his husband Eric made an investment to fully fund our Kids Connection program in 2019. Now, having kids of my own, if anything happened to me or a family member, I would want my children to have access to a program like this. And because of investments we are making now, we can ensure that if needed, the Tri-Cities Cancer Center would be there for me and my family. Bob Kelly, a former Tri-Cities Cancer Center Foundation board member and longtime member of our men's club, was impacted through investments made at the Tri-Cities Cancer Center. Both he and his wife, Ann, are cancer survivors. So when he heard about a new program at the Tri-Cities Cancer Center that was being supported by the foundation, he was very impressed by the depth and breadth of the services that the center offered. When I heard about the survivorship program, I remember thinking, it really closed the circle for cancer survivors and it provided the last element of complete care that can be found at the Tri-Cities Cancer Center. My family moved here in the late 80s and at that time, we were warned that we couldn't find good health care in this community. Fast forward 30 years, and now we have a world-class cancer center in our own backyard. And I think that says a lot about the impact personal investments can make on a region's health care. And Bob and Ann wanted to make just this kind of impact. The Kellys were able to use the opportunity of making a contribution to our foundation through their personal retirement accounts, which created a great tax benefit by gifting their required minimum distribution directly to the Tri-Cities Cancer Center Foundation, which allowed them to avoid paying federal tax on this income. In our case, we've been very blessed and did not need the required minimum distribution in our retirement. So this opened up an opportunity for us to contribute to areas that add to the quality of the community. The tax break is wonderful, but it's even better that we can use this income to benefit a great organization like the Tri-Cities Cancer Center. Thanks to investments from our community members like Bob and Ken, your Tri-Cities Cancer Center Foundation has been able to responsibly steward these dollars into making real, dramatic, and critical change to the availability of world-class cancer care in our community. Celebrating 25 years of community investments, the Tri-Cities Cancer Center is the community's leader in cancer prevention, early detection, world-class treatment, and survivorship. We're your Tri-Cities Cancer Center.